So it's Ulster. Got us underway in this beautiful balmy day in Port Elizabeth. They'll be heading to the high veld of Bloemfontein on the second section of this South African tour next week to play against the Cheetahs. And Ulster making a pretty decent start, turning the ball over. And really he had the opportunity to redress a little discipline of his own and kick the winning points with the last play of the game to set Ulster on their way with two successive wins and he sets Ulster on their way here in Port Elizabeth. John Cooney has landed 28 of his last 33 kicks including now his last eight so he's on a good run and this should be straightforward enough. You just wonder John Cooney with uh, Connor Murray suffering from this rather mysterious neck injury Will he be in Joe Schmidt's focus come November? Cooney McCluskey. Again, it takes two, three, four defenders in there. Ulster trying to narrow up this Southern Kings defence and then maybe take advantage on the outside. Going to get the ball first. Here is Warwick. Could see a... Very close to getting through himself there. Here is Cooney! And... Cooney continues to amass this vast quantities of points on his own. Another try. He scored one last week against Edinburgh. He's kicking everything and he's scoring two. Four approaching there now. Where is it? Treadwell. Give it space. And it's O'Connor. Just watch his right shoulder here coming into the contact area. You know, using your arms, but as a player, and you're, you're practicing, you're, you're rocking your training. Uh, that's the, that's the way, that's the way you're, you, you do it on a, on a Tuesday so and Thursday. Come off and his feet in the breakdown, he's very he's his arm in. He's made contact with the body, that's why it's a yellow card offence. Four. The war to try. Bobby to a very good line out take. I was talking to Bernard Jackman last week, the Dragons coach, and he said they've become a lot cuter this season the Southern Kings and in some aspects of their play and this is one of them and that does look like it yeah, might it well be a try there for Teeny Berger yeah I don't think he's actually tackled or anything he's just He's just fallen down with a few other players around him. And he's well, to give him a bit of space player. to watch this, please. For Sam? Yes. The player who picked up the ball after the collapse was not on his feet. He's on his knees. Um, and then he dived over and placed the ball over the line. Yeah, OK, so I'm going back from a penalty. Um, it was a collapse by two Ulster. That ball's travelled about 10 metres, so for me that's cynical. He's going to go to the bin. Yes, I agree with Thank you. Thank you very much. Two. Two. It's going to be no try. You've collapsed the mall that's travelled 10 metres. For me, that's a cynical offence. You go to the bin for that. The yellow card. Valunza goes beyond Astle this time, and it goes to Berger. Here's the drive again. At some pace, a lot of pace, and Valunza scores again for the Southern Kings. And they have been deadly with their driving mall early season. It is a part of their game that has really developed. And again trying to control an Ulster they got over the line this time Kutsia in possession squeezing with all his might and weight on that ball to get it down on the African turf and the former Springbok international scores in the country of his birth Jimmy Bell was saying that he enjoyed that help this game it's more of his, uh, his natural style Billy Burns here is Rob Herring. And decent mall. Herring breaks away. Must clear out Bandage hard and fast. Side. Shanahan. It should be another one. It is for Ulster. It's Angus Kernahan off the bench. Who scores in the corner for Ulster. Shanahan goes in. Can Ulster finish in some style here through Dysel as the hooter goes. 
Shanahan comes in, now it's McCluskey, here is Curtis, Angus Curtis with a score, and Angus Curtis gets Ulster's third try. Peter Nelson with the conversion, and the final whistle goes, and that means that Ulster will head north to Bloemfontein to play the Cheetahs on Friday night with their winning run intact. Started last season with four victories. Ulster started this season with three successes. Marcel Kutsia, one of Ulster's three try scorers here in the Nelson Mandela Bay Stadium. Final score, Southern Kings 7, Ulster 20.